Hey YouTube, so I just wanted to come real quick and tell you about the gel that I bought. I had heard about the um, Gorilla Snot gel, and I never even thought about buying it. But when I was in, um, when I went home to Chicago last week, I stopped by a Target, um, and they actually sold it. They don't sell it here at our Target, so I got the um, highest hold, the one that's a ten. So it's the Gorilla Snot, and the highest hold is. Gorilla Punk Undestructible. Okay. It's very cheap. It, it didn't even cost $3. It was two something. So I'm like, okay, well, let me get it. I don't use gel enough to really care about gel, to be totally honest. But this is what it looks like. So, yeah. It looks like it's not. It's thick, though. It doesn't. It's gluey. Okay. So you can see that. It's all the way upside down. When I pull it out. Okay. And it actually makes like, I guess the best way to put it is like spider webs. Like if you put this across you, you got to make sure that it's rubbed in because if you put some in your hands, like yesterday I wore my hair in a bun, I put some in my hands like this and I did like this to brush it up on the sides and I didn't make sure that it was just on both hands and it had a long string across there that wound up on my forehead. So. As far as the hold goes, it holds um, really well. It does have good hold. I was worried about the color. I remember back in the day, like the black gel, you know, used to, I used to have little spots of like the black gel on my hair because my hair was much lighter than the black gel. My hair was, hmm, it was almost, no, it was lighter than this. It was, it was very light, like a, my hair was like a very coppery red color. So the black gel didn't work, so I used to buy the clear. But when I rub this in, this doesn't show up. Did it make flakes and stuff? Um, I wore my hair in a bun all day. I felt I went to sleep. I didn't tie it up. Uh, when I woke up, nothing. I figured that, you know, if it was going to flake, it would be when I started to take it down. And it didn't. It did, but it didn't. Um, there was, like, one spot, like, right here where, um, let me get this off of my fingers. It was one spot, like, right here where... It wasn't like rubbed into my hands and rubbed through and brushed through properly. You know, when it was applied, it was a bit of a glob right there. Now, that glob didn't show up yesterday at all. I couldn't see it. But when I went to take my hair down today, I did have um, residue left over. Um, you know, I don't want to say it was sticky. It was dry, so it wasn't sticky. But, you know, there was definitely residue, and it was yellow like this. But only once I like actually broke the bond by taking my bun down. So it does leave some, but only if it's just globbed in, but not if it's brushed through. So um, I'd use it again. I mean, I don't use gel very often, but I'd use it if I needed a good hold for something. So, And then, like I said, it was only $2 and something. So thanks for watching.